Greetings and salutations and welcome to Open Plant Tech Tip Tuesday. This is Yasser bin Kesar and today we are looking at how we can define a new work breakdown structure in Open Plan Project Administrator. So I've already opened a metric project. So let's go and uh, go in schema editor and let's define a subunit. So select the plant elemental and define a new class subunit. Okay, now that we have a class, let's click uh, the name property and define it as the business key. Let's go back and uh, select our newly added class subunit and we have it here. Now let's uh, uh, drag and drop it in unit. You will see that it gives you a prompt to select the relationship. Let's say I don't want to use the unit has named item. So let's go back in schema editor and change and define a new uh, relationship. Let's call it unit has subunit. And let's select the source as unit and the target as subunit sub search k okay. okay so we now have a unit has subunit so now we need to relate the subunit with other the other classes so let's define subunit has a named item relationship sub unit has named item let's go and define subunit let's say pipeline so named item and okay so let's go back uh, in the associations tab and move the subunit in unit here we go so we now have unit has named item and so let's select unit has sub unit and now we'll drag the pipeline under subunit and let's select unit subunit has named item we will do that for the other equipment tray lines and finally the tray line and subunit and let's do a save all changes saved unit you can see that unit has subunit so let's go oh I forgot let's change the tag number as well because the piping network system is now associated with subunit rather than the unit so I will not change the unit name property here let's use that but let's change the relationship instance that we are we were picking up so let's do that sub underscore unit has named item and sub underscore unit okay let's verify that it's the correct yes it is do a save and go back and launch open plan modeler okay that was quick give it a second so that the strand preferences are up so now let's define a new pipeline you will notice that we now have subunit service and plant area which are directly associated with uh, the pipeline and when you're defining a subunit you, you get this unit uh, to be defined as well so let's say we define the unit as u and let's say the subunit is su save service as simply is and plant area as PA save let's go to property then you will see that we already have SU here so whatever we did with the, with the tag number is also working so SU let's define the number as 100 hit save and let's go and draw a pipe pipe elbow a bunch more okay let's launch explorer and see if everything that we just created is working 
So we have unit under that is U. Expand that to with SU. Then we have a pipeline, and finally we have the pipeline, and that is it.